Good evening, teacher. Hello, Manuel. Good evening. How are you tonight? I'm fine. Very, very, very uh, how do you say, cansado, teacher? Tired. Very tired. I'm going go. I'm going to go Usulutan at a cooking class with the guys of Bachillerato en Turismo. How do you say Bachillerato en Turismo? Yeah, let's see. If Turin's 11th grade. It is uh, primer año, segundo oh. año. Uh, se, se, second year. Ah, uh, second year. We say 12th year. 12th year. year. Yes. Oh. oh, high school students. I have a cooking class with high school ah. students. Okay. So it's very, very, very exciting. Uh, the guys uh, cook a uh, healthy food. Oh, fruit and, and uh, vegetables. Fruit, fruits and vegetables, uh, smoothies, uh, fruit cocktails. Uh, let me see. Uh, fresh salads, carrots, kale, ra uh, ra pasas, raisins. Yes, raisins. 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 Yes. Raisins. And um, share and. Mushrooms and carrots cream. Interesting. That sounds very interesting. It seems that today was a great day for you. Thanks, teacher. Okay, now let's see. You start saying I'm going. And it's I went. It's in past. I went. Oh, okay. I went. Yo fui ver. I went to a I high went. school. Yes. I went. I received the list of past past verbs. Cre creo. Oh, no. the list regular of and irregular. Regular and irregular verbs. Regular verbs. Yes. Yes. Okay, so you have that material for you to study. Um, I'm sure that you are going to learn a lot of new verbs. And the good things of that list is that you are going to find the regular verb separated by the sound, how you are going to pronounce them. And also you are going to find a list of irregular verbs that I am sure that they are going to be useful in the next English courses. What, what is the best form for apprentice the new verbs? Uh, the best form to learn birds and uh, listening uh, on YouTube, yes. you can find a video with the pronunciation of every bird and also with some sentences as examples. So using them in context, it's better than to be studying um, every single bird from a list. So you can do oh. that too. Okay. Okay, teacher. Hello, Katie. And everybody not no connecting. <laughs> uh, probably it's because of the El Salvador versus Mexico match. Ah, yes. Teacher, eh, las disculpas, voy conduciendo, salí tarde de trabajo. Okay, Heidi, just be careful. So, hello, Angelica, hello, Roxana. Hello, Rosa Amaya. Hello, Geris Ramirez and Cesar Elias. Welcome to the class. It's a pleasure to be. It's a pleasure to be with you tonight. So thank you for your punctuality. So yesterday we were studying about irregular verbs, simple past, and how to make sentence using those verbs: affirmative, negative, and also questioned, interrogative sentences. So tonight we are going to have the reading part of the section 
And also we are going to have some exercise related to the simple past tense. We have already studied a regular bird and also irregular bird. And there is a difference, right? When making the simple past tense, we already know that. So let me see. We are going to start tonight class, but first, before to go to today's topic, I'm going to see this. I'm going to show you the section number four. Let's see, this is section number four in the name of the section is, did you have fun? Did you have fun? The divertistas, that is the name of this section. So I hope you have already done this part. Espero que ya hayan hecho esta parte. If no, let me show you the exercise you have to complete. So the first exercise is this one. In this exercise, the instructions are change the verb in parentheses to the past to complete the story. You don't need to tie a period. It is already placed. So what you have to do here is to write the correct past form of every verb that is missing. You are going to find the verb in parentheses. And in the case of the second one, it says no call. Then it is a negative sentences and we're going to use didn't, didn't call. So that is the first exercise. And in the second, the second exercise, the instruction are complete the conversation by using the correct form of the verb in the past tense. Again, right? you have to complete the conversation usando la forma correcta de los verbos en paréntesis en tiempo pasado. And you are going to find some questions. And yesterday we studied how to make questions. So we are going to place the auxiliary did at the beginning of the sentence. And here we have the verb in parentheses in the case of affirmative and negative sentences. That is the second exercise you have to complete. And the next one is this. I'm scrambled the question by putting the words in the correct order. Remember to tie the question mark. In this, you are going to order uh, the word to make a question. Va a ordenar las palabras para hacer una pregunta. And it says, remember to tie the question mark. No se le olvide, ¿verdad? Recuerde escribir the question mark o digitar, digitar el signo de pregunta en cada uno de los ejercicios. En, en ese, ¿sí? Y esos son los ejercicios, ¿verdad? So, do you have any question about this section? No, teacher. No question. Ok, thanks a lot. Then let's go with tonight class. Let me share with you the presentation of tonight class. And we are going to study this tonight. The topic for today is weekend stories. Historias del fin de semana. And this is the reading. This is the reading part of the section. But before to go to the reading, we are going to solve some exercise for you to remember and for you to practice the simple past tense. So here we go. Look at this. How fast can you answer the following six questions? And I write seven, sorry. I add one more here. So number one, what did you learn yesterday? Can you tell me? What did you learn yesterday? That is the first question. So this is a question in past. What did you learn yesterday? I learned yesterday the um, irregular verb. Excellent, thank you. Good try, very good try. So yesterday is at the end of the sentence. I learned irregular bird yesterday. O al principio de la oración, yesterday, coma, I learned irregular birds. 
Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Uh, any other answer? What did you learn yesterday? I eat cereal for breakfast. Can you please repeat, Francisco? I eat cereal for breakfast. Oh, I ate. I ate cereal for breakfast. Okay, that is for the second. For the second question, what did you eat for breakfast? I ate cereal for breakfast. Thank you. When did you last tell a lie? ¿Cuándo fue la última vez que dijo una mentira? When did you last tell a lie? What's the past form of tell? Told. Told, okay, excellent. So I told a light. Yo dije una mentira. Y usted dice hace cuánto. You can say one minute ago, un minuto atrás, two hours ago, one day ago, five hours one ago. ago. Uh, five minutes ago. I told a light five minutes ago. Hace cinco minutos yo dije una mentira. Any other answer? When did you last tell a lie? When did you last tell a lie? I told a lie yesterday, for example. Last week. Last week. And I tell a lie. <laughs> One week. Ah, ago. okay. One week ago. I told a lie one week ago. Excellent. Number four, what did you have for dinner yesterday? Do you remember that? What did you have for dinner yesterday? I had for dinner pupusas. Okay, excellent. I had for dinner pupusas. Any other answer? I, I had... Oh, sorry. <laughs> spaghetti. Heidi say I had uh, for dinner. I have a spaghetti for dinner yesterday. Manuel. I had pork and tomato sauce for dinner yesterday. Thanks a lot. Any other answer? Do you remember? I have chicken for dinner. Excellent. For dinner uh, yesterday. Excellent. I had chicken for dinner yesterday. Thank you. Any other answer? The last answer. What did you have for dinner yesterday? One more answer. I had. I had bread with chicken for dinner yesterday. Thanks a lot. The next one. What did you watch on TV last weekend? What did you watch on TV last weekend? ¿Qué vio en la televisión el fin de semana pasado? I watch on TV last week Paw Patrol. Ah, okay, excellent. I watch on I watch Paw Patrol on TV last weekend. Paw Patrol. Thank you. Any other answer? Me, me too. <laughs> oh, Mario say me too. Pope Patrol. How do you say serious? Uh, sitcoms. I watch on TV only sitcom last weekend. Okay, only sequence. Uh, let me guess the squid game. Uh, I recommend a uh, blow blow of shoes. Ah, okay, Netflix. excellent. Thank I you. I watch on TV uh, Demon Slayer. Demon, Demon we, Slayer. That's oh, good. Yeah. Very good. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> Demon Slayer mm -hmm. is that anime? Second season. 
Okay, Demon Slayer. I'm going, to, I'm going to write that, Demon Slayer. The name is interesting. And let's see the next one. What did you do yesterday? Oh, sorry. How did you get to work today? How did you go? How did you get to work today? ¿Cómo llegó al trabajo hoy? I get uh, in the bus to work Okay. Today. I go to work by bus. I got in bus. I got to work by bus today. Thank you. Any other answer? I go to work drive motorcycle. Okay, I go to work by motorcycle today. Any other answer? I go to work by car. Okay, excellent. I go to work by car. Or oh, I drove my car. I drove my car. Or oh, I rode my bicycle to work. And also I took the bus. I took the bus to work. Excellent. The next one, seven. What did you do yesterday? Yesterday I woke up at 6 a.m. After that, I, I went to my job. And my job, I... I how do you say did I did my home my, my homework? I don't know. Como tareas in in el trabajo? How do you say? Oh, you want to say ah, uh, yo hice mis deberes, pero lo que tengo que hacer en el trabajo duties. I did my duties. Uh -huh. I did my duties at work. Sus deberes en el trabajo. I, I did know. my duties at work. Okay. okay. After that, I went to my house and. and in my house, uh, I took a little moment for my for that. Okay. okay, excellent answer. Thanks a lot. So it says, I went home. You say, I go. It, it's in past, so I went home. Excellent answer. Thank you, Jonathan. Any other answer? What did you do yesterday? I advanced in the platform. Okay, excellent. I sold exercise on the platform or I worked on the platform. Thank you. Any other answer? What did you do yesterday? I played a lot of video games at night. Thanks a lot. I played a lot of video games at night. Any other answer? One more, one more. I worked yesterday in the final report of my of the minel. Okay, thank you. Or, or, or educational ministry. Okay, Is correct. Thank you a lot. We can say minet or education ministry too. So minet is la abreviación, but minet. Okay, yes. Then let's go with this. Organize the following words according to the correct ED pronunciation. Vamos a ordenar los siguientes verbos de acuerdo a cómo vamos a pronunciar la ED en cada uno de esos verbos. The end of each verb, the EDN. How we're going to pronounce this? We're going to order them by sound. Let's see, for example, sound, sound T or T. ¿Qué verbos irían debajo de ese sonido? Loved. Loved. No, I mean, no, no, no. Yes, love. Uh, uh, loved. Or no, loved. The, the love, love is, is this sound. In waited, light, decided, cold. Enjoyed, relaxed, started, kissed, smiled, invited, arrived. Arrived is, is, is one. Arrived. Okay, you say arrived is one. Okay, any other option? Kissed. 
Kissed. Yes. Kissed. Kissed. Smiled. 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 Okay. Light. Okay, light is another one. Light. Kiss. Light. Okay, let's see which of them. We have the first one is light. The other one is relaxed. Kissed. What about sound D? With this sound. White. White. Waited. Waited. Enjoy. Yes. Oh. Enjoyed. Cold. Cold is a one. Smiled. Smiled. Okay, let's check in. The first one is loved. Loved. Cold. Cold. Enjoyed. Smiled. Loved, smiled. cold, enjoy, smiled. And the uh, rest. Right. And the rest is ID. Ah, okay, a ride is another one. A ride is with sound D. A ride. And with E, it with the final ED pronounced as it sound. The rest of them waited. Waited. The next one is started. 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 Yes. Invited. 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 Okay. Invited. okay. Who wants to try to pronounce this very correctly? Who wants to try tonight? Practice, it's your time for you to practice. It's time for you to practice. So who wants to participate? Let me know who wants to participate and practice this bird. Nobody wants to participate tonight? Then let me choose someone. Okay, like. Okay, thank you, Mario. Kissed, loved, called, enjoyed. Smiled, waited, decided, start, started, 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 started. invited, 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 invited. yes, invited. Thank you. Any other volunteer? The last volunteer for me, teacher. Point. Thank you. So you can start. Light. Relaxed, kissed, loved, cold, enjoyed, smiled, waited, decided, started, started, invited. Invited. Thank you. Thank you very much. Excellent job. So let's go with the next. Error correction. So look at this sentence. Paulina didn't sound very well. What is the mistake in this sentence? Really? El verbo no necesita ¿Sí? ir en pasado porque ya lleva didn't. Okay, excellent. So it is no sun. Tiene que ser. Sí. So, sí. 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 Paulina didn't sing very well. Excellent. Let's see this one. My wore a beautiful jacket on his birthday. What is the mistake? It's irregular verb. Okay, thank you. It is an irregular verb. So, ¿cuál es la forma en el pasado de wear? Word. 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 My word, a beautiful jacket on his birthday. 
Thank you. That is the mistake in that sentence. Let's see the next one. Where did you found that money? Where did you found that money? En verbo tiene que ir en normal. In present. Ah. Okay, excellent. The verbs must be in present. Fine. Where did you find that money? Thank you. Let's see the next one. Did Oscar Wilde wrote many novels? The verb no es grow. Why? No. Right. 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 Okay. Right. Excellent. Right. The next. Albert didn't drink any alcohol. Drink. No es drink, sino drink. 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 Okay. Albert didn't drink any alcohol. So let's see. Let's continue practice. Look at this question, and here I have the answer. So we're going to practice. I need a volunteer, please. Two volunteers to practice at this time, please. Me, teacher. Thank you. Just a second. OK, uh, who say me? Can you say your name, please? Patty. Okay, thank you, Patty. And any other volunteer? Patty and me, teacher. Thank you, Manuel. So, Patty and Manuel. So, Patty, you are going to read the question, and Manuel, you are going to read the answer in the first four. In las primeras cuatro, por favor. Okay. Las dos columnas de preguntas. And this is the first question, and this is the answer. Then we have number two. This is number uh, okay. two. This is okay. number three and number four. Okay. 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 Ready. What did you, okay. What did you have for breakfast this morning? I had beans, cream, and cheese. Okay. Two. What was the last film you saw? I saw, I saw Spider-Man Far From Home. Ah, it's a new movie. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Three, who did you last talk to on the telephone? I talked to my mom. Okay. What did you last read? I read Harry Potter books. Excellent job, thank you. I need um, other two volunteers. Who wants to participate? Me, teacher. Me. Preguntas? Okay, me but say your name, me, please. Me and your name, please. Kelia. Okay, Kelia and? Eric. Kelia and Eric, okay, excellent. So, Kelia, can you please ask the question? And Eric, you are going to read the answer for the following what, three questions. What time did you go to bed last night? I went to bed at uh, 11, how was it? 11.30. 11 11 yes. Yes, sir. What did you watch on TV last night? I watched the... Uh, a movie. Okay. And what was the last photograph you took? I took a selfie. Thanks a lot. It took, yes. took or took? Took. I took, took a selfie. Yes. Okay. Thank you. The last three. Who wants to participate in the last three questions and answers? Me, teacher. Hey, thank you. Thank you, Heidi. Heidi and Francisco. Thank you, Francisco. Heidi and Francisco. So, Heidi, can you please read the question? And, Francisco, you are going to read the answer. You can practice. Okay. What did you buy yesterday? I bought 
a candy. What was the last meal you cooked? I cooked roasted chicken. Excellent, thank you. This one is missing. When did so, you last see the sea? I saw the sea two years age. Two years. Two, what did you say? Two years <laughs> ago. Years ago. Two years ago. Excellent. Excellent job. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Patty. Thank you, Kayla, Eric, Heidi, Francisco, and Manuel. Thanks a lot. Uh, so now with your own information, con su propia información, who wants to answer the first question? What did you have for breakfast this morning? I ate eggs and beans. Okay, excellent answer. I ate eggs and beans, fried beans. Frijoles fritos en huevo. Excellent. Thank you. I eat two sandwich. Okay. I ate. It's in pass. I ate two sandwiches. Thank you. Excellent answer. The last answer. I, I ate cereal with milk. Thank you. Excellent. I ate cereal and milk. Excellent job. Thank you. I Let's go. ate three pupusas. I ate three pupusas. Okay, what was the ingredient? ¿De cuál era el ingrediente en las pupusas? Chipilín, mora. Crazy. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> eh, eh. Beans and cheese. Oh, beans and cheese. The classic pupusas. Cheese and beans. Now let's right. see. Okay. <laughs> See, arroz o maíz, rice or corn. <laughs> <laughs> rice or corn? Rice. Rice. Were they delicious? Very more delicious. Oh, oh, they were very delicious. Thank you. Now let's go with the second. What was the last film you saw? ¿Cuál fue la última película que vio? I saw Rápido y Furioso. <laughs> Fast and Furious. Nice. I saw Fast and Furious. The last one. Mi pobre angelito. Okay. <laughs> Mi pobre angelito. I saw the Elizabeth, the Golden Age. Elizabeth and the Golden Age. Any other answer? I saw Coda. Thank you. Okay, thanks. I saw Cantinflas. <laughs> okay, I saw Cantinflas. Oh, Cantinflas uh, had very good movies. They are I so funny. I saw Free Guy. Frida, okay. Free Guy. Oh, Free Guide. It's a new one. It's a new movie. It's a new one. Free guide. Excellent. Any other answer? The last answer. I saw play calamar. Oh, a squid game. I saw a, ski, a squid game sitcom. And let's go with the next question. Um, bueno, escoja una. Which one? Choose one. What did you last read? Ah, okay. What did you last read? ¿Cuál fue lo último que leyó? The newspaper. Oh, wait. Someone is making art with my screen. I this? read the Prince Machiavelli. Prince Machiavelli or okay. Machiavelli Prince. Oh, Machiavelli Prince. El Príncipe Machiavelli. 
Interesting. Yes. Veronica decides to die. Oh. <laughs> Veronica decides to die. Okay, thank you. Paulo Coelho. Paulo Coelho, muy bien. Excellent. I read a program with my work. Okay, can you please turn off your microphone? It is when that is making some interference and we can hear very well. And let I me read, check. I read tutorial Power BI. Oh, a tutorial, okay. Okay, this is the microphone, I'm sorry. And let me see if I can erase those lines there. Okay, just give me a second. The power went off here at my house. So let's see, okay. let's... Bueno, voy a dejar de compartirle la pantalla un momento para que se borren las líneas. Y then we're going to continue. Ok, now this is clean again. So, which other question do you want to discuss with your classmate? Choose one and tell me. Which question do you want to discuss with your classmate? What did you buy yesterday? Thank you. What did you buy yesterday? What did you buy yesterday? I bought a bottle of wine. Thank you. I bought a bottle of wine uh, for cooking, right? Yes. Okay. Prepare prepare a meat with red wine. Oh, that sounds delicious. I want to taste it. Uh, any other answer? What did you buy yesterday? I bought uh, a veget vegetable. Okay, I bought baseballs. Thank you. Any other answer? No more answer. Then let's I choose. I bought a uh, fruit. I bought fruit. Excellent. Choose the last one. Choose the last one. I bought ice cream. I bought ice cream. Excellent. Then let's see. Let's last vacation. There are some fast, simple questions about your last vacation. Do you remember where, where did you go on your last vacation? Where did you go? And you say, I went to. I went to the beach. Thank you. Excellent answer. I Me robó la frase. <laughs> Lo siento. <laughs> I went to the park. Me too. Ah, okay. I went to the park. I went to Fureza. I went to Fureza. Thank you. Let's see. I went to Peñón de Comasagua. Oh, interesting place. I went to Peñón de Comasagua. Is it beautiful there? Is I, style, I style in um, Apaneca Hotel. Okay. okay. I stay in Apaneca Hotel. Interesting. How much money did you spend? How much money did you spend your last vacation? Who 
$100, oh, do you want to remember that? No se quiere acordar cuánto gastó. Let's see, who did you go with you? Who did you go with? ¿Con quién fue? With my friends, with my family. With, with my, my children. Family. My family. Family, with my family. Okay, excellent. Did, did you stay in a hotel? Yes, a surf is all in the beach, San Blas. Okay. Okay, and the next question, where did you go during the night? Where did you go during the night? Um, you can say, I didn't go to any place. I stay at the hotel. No salí, verdad, en la noche. It's dangerous, right? I stayed at the hotel. Estuve en el... I went to a party. Oh, excellent. During the night. Two. I went to a party. I went to a party. Nice. So let's see, party. These are some simple past questions about parties. When was the last time you went to a party? And you say, I went to a party last weekend, last month, last year, two days ago. I went to a beach party three years ago. Okay, excellent answer. I went to a beach party three years ago. Any other answer? Practice, guys. This is your turn to practice. When was the last time you went to a party? I went to a party, Golden Fest, in the beach. Okay, excellent. I went to a Golden Fest on the beach. Any other? Any other answer? Now, I, again, I have this question. Who did you go with? Con quien fue? With your friends, with your husband, with your wife, with your kids. Perdón, teacher. Eh, compañeros de trabajo, ¿cómo sería? Co-workers. Co-workers. Yes, I went with my co-workers. Okay, thank you. How did you get there? How did you get there? ¿Cómo llegó a ese lugar? By train, by airplane, by bus. By car. My car. By car, excellent. How many people attended the party? Do you remember how many people were there? How many people attend in the party? And you say, 100 people attended to the party. 200 people attended to the party. Teacher. Yes. Attended sería asistir. Yes. Okay. ¿Cuántas personas asistieron a la fiesta? Okay. 2,000 people attend in the beach party, in the last beach party. Okay, 2,000 people. Uh, what did you eat or drink? Do you remember this? What did you eat or drink? Beer. I drank beer. I drank beer. We drank coffee. I okay, we drank coffee. I ate meat. I ate meat, excellent answer. Okay, let's go with the next thing. Reading, this is the reading part. Look, she is Kelly. She is Kelly and Kelly says this. I have a great weekend. I went to my best friend Helen's wedding. She got married at home. 
All her friends and family went. She looked fantastic. She wore a beautiful dress. After the ceremony, her parents served a wonderful meal. I'm really happy for her and I really like her husband. Do you have any new vocabulary at this part? A word that you don't know? What is a wedding, for example? Boda. Boda. Excellent. Best friend. Mejor amigo. Do you have a best oh. friend? Do you have a best friend? Yes. Yes, of course. Right? Uh, let's see the next one. Dress, what's the meaning of dress? Vestido. Dress, vestido. Wonderful. Maravillosa comida, wonderful meal. Okay, excellent. Una comida maravillosa, delicious. Super delicious. And husband? Esposo. Esposo. Esposo, okay. So let's see, let's answer this question. Number one, and did she have an awful weekend? Did she have an awful weekend? No, she didn't. No, she didn't, thank you. Where did she go? She, she went to Gwen. Uh, Helen's wedding. She went to Helen's wedding. Excellent. Oh, sorry. Let's see. Did Helen look fantastic? Yes, she. Yes, she, she did. didn't. She did. She, yes, she did. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Where did Helen get married? Helen got married at her home. Thank you. That is the correct answer. And who did sell the food? Wonderful meal. Oh, wonderful meal. Ah, is it the address? Ah, oh, her no. parents. Served. Her parents. Her parents served the food. A wonderful meal. Oh, we can say that. Her parents served a wonderful meal. But the question is who? Quien? Quien sirvió la comida? Helen's parents. Mm. Helen's parents served the food. So let's see the answer. Number one, did she have an awful weekend? Yes, she did. That's not the correct answer. Tuvo un fin de semana muy malo? No, she didn't. That's the answer. She went to her best friend wedding. And yes, she did. She got married at home. Helen's parents served the food. So let's go with the next one. Read and answer the question. Robert and Robert said, I had an awful weekend. My friend and I went to a rock concert. I have a terrible time. It took three hours to drive there. I didn't like the music at all. And after the concert ended, our car broke down. I called my parents and they came and go us. We finally got home at 10 this morning. I am so tired. New vocabulary in this reading? Awful. Awful. Horrible. Okay. I have a very bad weekend. Do we move fin de semana muy malo, horrible. Horrible. Yeah. So let's see, my friends and I went to a rock concert. And then any other work that is new for you in this paragraph? Broke down. Broke down is arruinarse. Broke down. Ah, okay. The car broke down. Ah, okay. I called my parents and they came and got us. And finally, Got home at 10 this morning. I'm so tired. 
Yeah. Wait, so number one, did Robert have a good weekend? No, he didn't. No, he didn't. That is the correct answer. Thank okay. you. No, he didn't. Who did he go to the concert with? Robert and his friend. Oh, he went with his friends. What time did he get home? What time did he get home? Oh. At 10 this uh, the morning. He get, get. 10, 10. Three he hours to drive. He, go, oh. he got okay. home. He got home. At uh, ten uh, in the yeah. in the ten morning. Ten a.m. He get home at ten this morning. Okay, let's see the next one. Did the car break down? Yes, it did. Okay, yes, a second. Okay, thank you for turning off your microphone. So, did the car break down? Yes, it. Yes, it yes. did. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Yes, it did. That is a correct answer. Okay, here we have question number one. It says, no, he didn't. He went with his friend. He got home at 10 this morning. And yes, he did. Uh, to, to volunteers to practice this conversation. Question and answer, please. To volunteers who want to participate. Me? Uh, me. Thank you, Vanessa and Manuel. So Manuel, you are going to read the question and Vanessa, you are going to read the answer. So you can start, please. Did Robert have a good weekend? No, he didn't. Who did he go to the concert with? He went with his friend. What time did he get home? He got home at them this morning. Did the car break down? Break break down? Yes, it did. Thank you. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Thank you. Let's see the next paragraph. Erin, she is Erin. And she said, I have an interesting weekend. I went camping for the first time. My friends took me. We left on Saturday and drove to the campsite. First, we put, we put up the tent. Then we built a fire, cooked dinner, and told stories. We got up early on Sunday and went fishing. I caught a fish. I didn't really like camping, but I learned a lot. New vocabulary in this small paragraph. What's the meaning of interesting, for example? Interesante. First time. Primera hora. Okay. In, in this case, it's primera vez. First time. Uh, we left on Saturday. What's the meaning of that sentence? We left on Saturday. Salimos en sábado. Excellent. Salimos el sábado and drove to the campsite. Y conducimos al campamento. First, we put up the tent. What does that sentence mean? Levantamos la tienda. Excellent. Thank you. Then we built a fire. Construimos, 
Construimos una fogata. Construimos una fogata. Cook dinner and told stories. Cocinamos la cena y contamos historias. We got up early on Sunday and we went fishing. What is fishing? Pescar. Pescar. I caught a fish. What's the meaning of that sentence? I caught a fish. Oh, yo atrapé un pescado. I didn't really like camping, but I learned a lot. Question number one. How did she get to the campsite? How did she get to the campsite? She walked with my his friend. ¿Cómo llegó al campamento? That's the question. How did she get to the campsite? She, she drove. Oh, she drove. She drove. Excellent. What did she do at the camp? ¿Qué hizo en el campamento? What did she do at the camp? She was a fire. Okay, she built a fire. A fire. She put up the tent. Cooked she, dinner. She went fishing. She went fishing, excellent. Did she catch a fish? She a fish. Did she yes, catch she a fish? Did. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Did she like camping? Yes, she did. Yes, she did. How was her weekend? Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, right. her, interesting. her weekend was interesting. Now let's see the answer that I have here. She dropped the campsite. She put up the tent. She built a fire. She cooked dinner and told stories then number three it says no she didn't she had an interesting weekend then let's see this is the end so do you have any question about today class questions mm -hmm. no teacher, teacher. No, tell me what is your question. Yo, yo tendría una pregunta, eh, teacher, pero bueno, quizás no, no, no con lo de la clase, sino cuando más o menos terminaríamos el este módulo. Eh, ¿Cuándo terminamos el módulo? Sí, la otra semana, ¿verdad? Next week, yes, and Thursday. Teacher, ¿y con el certificado cuándo se va a poder generar? Oh, ok, um, I'm going to ask again. Voy a consultar otra vez. When, when you are going to be able to see your diploma. Ok. Any, any other question? Teacher, ¿verdad que usted dijo de que no es obligatorio hacer todos los ejercicios, pero que sí los podemos hacer como práctica? ¿Y ¿Los ejercicios de la plataforma? Ajá. No. I said los, that... eh, los ejercicios sí, los que están en los videos, esos no son ponderizados. Los demás sí. Así es, son los comentarios de los videos los que eran opcionales. Todos los ejercicios sí tenemos que realizarlos. Ajá, ajá, eso, a eso me refiero, a las discusiones que hay abajo ajá. de cada video. Ok, they are optional if you want to participate. But if you want to ah, practice, okay. you can do it. You can do it. Ok, thank you. Pero, pero los, ejer los otros ejercicios, yes, you are obligated to do that. Right? Ajá, you sí, have sí, to. sí, eso sí. <laughs> ok, eh, any other question? ¿Cómo va el partido? Sí, por favor, informe. Salvador, zero, México, one. Yes. Oh, Como are, siempre. <laughs> we are losing the game. <laughs> hay fe, hay fe todavía. Yes. Hay fe que le van a hacer una... 
Oh, ¡Ay, qué... tan mala! <risa> Unos tres más que les estén. <risa> les tienen fe a las selecto ustedes. <risa> ok, bueno, por aquí. Media hora de ayuno y oración. <risa> no, creo que con ellos necesitan más que una limpia. <risa> oh, tana, <risa> ¡Qué <risa> mala! <risa> Okay, so let's see. I hope that you enjoy the second half of the match. Espero que disfrute el segundo tiempo del partido. So let's see. Uh, any other question about the class? Mm, no, teacher. No, teacher. I understand. No more question. Okay, excellent. Um, just don't forget, please, to continue working on the platform exercise. Exercises and evaluation, right? It is important that you finish section four, section five, and also the final test. If you can do it this coming weekend, it's going to be really nice. Si pueden hacerlo este fin de semana, que espero que tengan un poco de tiempo libre, que, que lo puedan hacer durante ese tiempo, porque justo la última antes de la última clase usted ya tiene que haber completado todo o sea el próximo jueves before the last class eh, usted ya tiene que haber terminado todos los ejercicios todas las evaluaciones en la plataforma y entonces please right? y ya mañana es jueves then you are going to have um, the weekend so you can work on that So do it, please. Y si ya lo hizo, ya lo terminó, felicidades. Qué bueno, ¿verdad? Qué bueno que ya lo haya hecho. Felicitaciones. Y los demás podemos alcanzar a los que ya lo hicieron. So you can do it. Y no more questions. No more comments. No, teacher. Ok. No. Bueno. No, teacher. Bueno, entonces vamos a sufrir con la selecta, ¿verdad? ¿Cuántos goles más nos caen? No. No. <laughs> bye bye then. Bye. Good night. Bye. 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 Bye.